Hey guys, I am Chris Kaler and I'm Amber Foss from QGN and today we are back in the guys with Demon Slayer episode 13 or 6 from season 2 uh, This one is called, I'm sorry I don't have it right here Jesus, Jesus, I don't know, we'll see Damn, we'll see Another flashy thing Another flashy thing perhaps <laughs> So last episode, Tengen uh, found the nest Hinosuke found the nest and so they all ended up at the nest. Yeah, he, he warmed <laughs> his wing to it. Yes, and he freed uh, Zenitsu and the two wives that were stuck in there. They kicked ass until Tengen showed up and then finished kicking ass. <laughs> uh, we saw a little bit of the backstory with him and his wives, how he puts them first and he wants them to put themselves first too. He really cares about them. He really, really cares about them. And meanwhile, you got Tanjiro still trying to, you know, fight Daki and uh, he's switched to sun breathing because it fits more with his style. He doesn't handle water breathing the way he should in order to kill a Kizuki. So he's going sun breathing, but it takes a toll on his body. And right now he's got a fucking fever because he needs to get his te temperature really high to be fast enough. So freaking hell, Tanjiro. Yeah, he's not in a good position, but he, he, he's got to fight for his life. He here, needs so. to do the job. Yeah. So this is where we are. Uh, I'm also wondering if when Tengen cut all the ribbons, did he free everyone? Because I didn't I'm see sure, people. I'm sure he did. I'm sure he did. Yeah. We will see. So let's jump in this episode and see what happens next. Don't forget to subscribe, you guys, if you want to see more of these episodes and check out our Patreon for the full-length reactions. In the meantime, let's go. <laughs> that one shot fucking scared us. <laughs> She acts bored and like not impressed, but she does get surprised here and there. Yeah, but so far, he's not really a match against her. I know. I'm wondering if you can mix breathing styles. Like switch from one to the other if you're in a good position for both. I don't know. Yeah. Could be. Could. It would have to be mid-fight, because I know he just switched, but... <laughs> Like, just go from one to the other. Yeah. Would it be too hard? Uh, hard because... What's my part in English? Steam? Steam, yeah. Maybe steam breathing? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> oh, damn. It needs to end well this time, because we can't take more grief. <laughs> Come on, my man. Oh! But yeah, that's a part of her. Yeah. Oh! Is she gonna get stronger? Um, I'm afraid. Oh, so. Oh. Um. Yeah, it looks good. She evolved. <laughs> Uh, get inside, uh, buddy. No, no. He's trying to save you. Oh, shit. <laughs> You're gonna have to take it, buddy. Oh, shit. She has a really, really flashy style. Ooh. Oh, damn. Man. She's way too strong now! Uh, or per- A per six? What? <laughs> We're just a pebble in her shoes! She's gonna love Tengen. <laughs> oh, the disrespect! He said it wasn't gonna happen again, and now it's happening. Yeah. Oh! Oh! We're seeing red? What just happened? Where's... Kiminiは悪いことをした。教授郎のために泣いてくれてありがとう。初対面があのようなことになってしまい恥ずかしく自分の布に打ちのめされていたとき畳みかけるように最愛の妻が病死した。Still no excuse, but... Oh, she's 
私が教えることを放棄した後でも炎の呼吸の指南書を読み込んで鍛錬し柱となった,たった3巻しかない本で君はもっとすごい力がある君の選ばれた使い手は君のように生まれつき赤い朝が額にあるそうだあそいつなるスカーいいえ信じろさんこの傷は生まれつきのものじゃない、okay. 弟が火鉢を倒した時かばってできたやけどですさらにその上を最終選別で負傷して、so、父は生まれつき額にうすく技があったようですが、oh, 俺は違います you can still do this shit Is it why he's got blood in his, in his eyes? Like, because the stuff is rejecting him? Oh man! Okay, we said it last episode, he pushes through the pain. He's coming after you, bitch. Oh. You don't leave. Oh, cut her, cut her. Shit, I wanted to cut her. At least once. He got her, he got her foot. Oh, just like your well, father or ancestor, I don't know. He looks badass. <laughs> oh, she's the same. It's Muzan. It's Muzan. Yep. Someone he freaks out yeah, over. And then there's some breathing holder. Yeah. yeah. We assumed it was his father, but people were telling me in the comments that it could have been an ancestor. No. In any case, someone who freaks out. Someone who was demon. cool. And we look like like the the reincarnation of that person. <laughs> Same thing. We need a few more years, but there you go. Okay, you did okay. <laughs> Damn! Tanjiro needs your help? Get on your knees! <laughs> yeah. But just like Anduku, I'd rather have him smiling and happy. Yeah? And laughing. <laughs> Well, we will make you remember, oh yeah. We got the fat back no jutsu, girl. She We're gonna make you remember. Her life was such a shitty one that she rebelled against it, but like, doesn't give you the fucking right to kill people. Oh shit. Yeah, but he's more determined now. <laughs> he's got blood in his eyes. Come on, buddy. Oh shit. Oh! Woohoo! He's the natural of this. Like, slicing through butter, right? It is a burning pain. Oh damn, it looks so cool. <laughs> you scared? There's a reason but why your master Are we gonna it. be fine afterwards? If it is destroying his body, which I, I think it is, he doesn't give a shit. He's a buff thing right now. He's gonna suffer later. Almost. Almost. Oh, I got so close. Okay. It looks so crazy. Oh. No, you're faster. You've awakened your shotting gun. <laughs> He's more in tune with everything. Oh. oh, you can't move, bitch! <laughs> Watch me, bitch! <laughs> oh, God! Oh, shit! We're 
gonna be in so much pain later, right? Nice. Another another book. Yes. Oh my god, are you possessed, man? What? What? He's not breathing. <laughs> so close. Oh, so thank you, thank you, sibling. Well, we're coming. Yeah, the, the, the team is coming. So we're coming, bitch. Oh, oh, oh. Thank Let's you. Go. Hey, hey. <laughs> not my brother, you bitch. Yeah. Oh. She's the same as her brother. She's like, oh shit. <laughs> Damn. Mm. Oh, she's jealous that he got favorites. She's not her his favorite, but but she eludes him. He mentioned her. Yeah. You don't talk about another girl when you're with her. <laughs> No. Come on. No. Go. 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 Um. You can do it. You can use the blood. Like yeah. Yeah. Your demon art, maybe. Come on, let's go. Just like your brother. Determination. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. Don't underestimate her. Whoa. When did that happen though? Oh! She broke it! She's all fucking out! Oh shit! Let's go! <laughs> okay! What is this? You almost killed her brother, so yeah, she's pissed. She would be like an, a fucking upper, upper rank Kizuki. <laughs> I really love how he keeps them with him like that. Take that bitch! Oh, come on! <laughs> uh, you are not prepared for this. She regenerates really quickly. When did that happen? In between seasons. Damn! We don't see it, but I'm sure that she's turning in her box. In, in her, in her box. box. Yeah. yeah. She gets real tiny and then she fights. It would make sense that if Tanjiro is getting stronger, Nezuko would also be getting stronger. And they are similar in, in the same way where, you know, when they get really mad or whenever, you know, they see injustice or something, like, their blood pumps faster. Like, they get tunnel vision, they get really intense. Like, Tanjiro managed to, because of his sheer fucking willpower, become stronger, faster, more focused. He did stop but breathing. I but I think that he probably hold his breath. Yeah, well, that, yeah, that's what he was doing, and I think maybe doing that is what kind of slowed down everything for him, which is weird because we need to learn more about that because this, the entire fucking point is to breathe. It's the way that you control your heart rate, I guess. But I mean, it helps, you... yeah. But then, like, him not breathing, I'm guessing it's more than that, but it looks like stop, to stop breathing really helped him, which goes against everything we learned. But then again, sun breathing is the first breathing style. It would make sense that it's a bit different than the others. So much stuff to learn about it. Yeah, and we don't know shit. That's so freaking cool. Yeah, the thing about the scar or the mark on the forehead, we never really knew for sure. Now we know how that happened. He wasn't born with it. No, he wasn't born with it, which doesn't make him a chosen one to wield uh, the sun, the, the, the breathing style, which I actually like because we have enough of chosen ones, you know, mm -hmm. those were, you know, they're good because they were born to oh, be I mean, good. Do you remember maybe in Tin Wolf, when the main character, Scott, became Scott. a... Scott. Scott. Yeah. Became a true alpha with his sheer willpower. 
-hmm. Like he wasn't a chosen one, but it's sure well. Oh, it's not the same thing. No, I mean he wasn't. He may not be a chosen one for to wield the sunbreathing techniques, mm -hmm. but his sheer willpower and what he went through will be that he's going to be worthy of things uh, a hold of the sunbreathing techniques. Well, I'm assuming that the reason why it's so hard on his body to use it is because he's not made to use the technique. But yes, his motivation, his determination, is what is making him forget about the pain kind of like what she was asking like are you are, aren't you feeling are you okay <laughs> uh it's because like when he's so focused he doesn't think about that he doesn't you know he doesn't notice it he just goes forward he needs to go forward he, he won't allow another carnage to take place and one just happened and he was there to stop it and that didn't happen so he he's literally go. saw red mm -hmm. <laughs> and so but i like it because it, we are used to characters who they were born to be great you know yeah. they they, add, they they are born with the ability to you know do this amazing thing that's stronger than anyone else but for tanjiro to not be a chosen one to for him to push through and uh, obtain this this technique his own way by doing the hard work i think well i would assume chosen ones also have to work to get the breeding style but that the fact that it doesn't come natural to him in that way makes him more special to me he's kind of like a true underdog who yeah. rises and you know above all the the difficulties and the obstacles and he, he reaches for the strongest weapon not because he he can but because he has to you know but who said that the first older of the sun breeding techniques didn't just get it like this, you know? We know nothing about the sun breathing style. Like, we know nothing about, like, if it's really true. Like, the, uh, Rengoku's dad learned about, like, heard about the mark and stuff. And his dad, Tanjiro's dad, did have the mark. How to fake mark. Yeah. Doesn't necessarily mean anything. And, like, could mean that, you, doesn't mean you're born with it. That maybe you gain it in the future. Maybe it has nothing to do with sun breathing. Maybe it's a coincidence. Well, I mean, we know nothing about it. We do know that in many genres, Usually the villain twist creates their own enemy, right? So well, at least the first demon. Uh, we needed to get the breathing, like we needed to be able to fight the demon. No, so. I know, but I mean, maybe the fact that uh, Kibutsuji, by killing our family, allowed, allowed oh, us to become good. a sun breathing holder, you know? Well, it definitely gave us the motivation to try. <laughs> yeah. uh, he is, by the way, so fucking afraid or of our ancestor, of the, the wielder of the sun breathing, that his demons have memories of him freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, oh shit. It's kind of like instinct, kind of like when, you know, your ancestors had to flee, so they dev when they, you know, uh, well, evolution leads to you having certain responses to certain triggers because your ancestors like have to Like on the on the board, something? So, well, no, like kind of like um, the reason why so many humans have trypophobia is because back in the day, back in the early days, everything that had to do with uh, holes in the skin or stuff like that meant skin disease, death. So we freak out over that probably because our ancestors really were freaked out over that like yeah, it, it was just, it's fucked up how that works but just, it's true just don't remind me what it is please <laughs> yeah don't look for photos it's it no. really freaks me out no. but like or you know the reason why um certain animals would react a certain way and it's instinct instinct comes from generations of of conditioning of conditioning and stuff so it's kind of like the same here uh muzan being the first one was so afraid to face it, you know, he, he probably thought he was the strongest there was, like, we don't know how he became what he is, but he was probably, like, the, the type of character who was like, I'm above everyone else, he still has that attitude, like, he doesn't think anyone could face him, but if someone with the sun breathing technique faced him before, and he almost died, he would be, like, it would be ingrained in his being, and now he's kind of transferring that to his other demons, so like if you see that you run like you freak out and you run. He's not saying that, but it's kind of it's inst instinct instinct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh yeah she got a she got surprised real quick. You never met the the two you know siblings the Kamado siblings here and no. uh, but I'm so I'm really glad that uh, Nezuko is. I don't Getting want to say stronger. upgrade <laughs> upgrading or something or evolving. Well, she's got tattoos and a and a horn now. Yeah, and she can regenerate like a Kizuki from the upper six. 
It's fucking cool. She's getting stronger. She needs to be able to keep up. Like we're going with bigger <laughs> enemies and stuff. So, and she hasn't even used like the 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 blood art or anything. But do you think that she's getting stronger because Tensor is getting stronger? Like they may be connected like this, or just because the the situations kind of require her to become stronger? Maybe both. I think the fact that Tanjiro is on the ground and he's not getting up, like he's done. Like I think his body took too much. He's fucking bleeding from the eyes at this point. Like he, mm. he needed someone to defend him and so the situation called for it. So she rose to the occasion. Uh, and it's also time has passed. Maybe she gets stronger with time. She's not like the same, like the other demons. No, she mean, doesn't she, regenerate. She got stronger by slipping through years. She, she does that. She doesn't need to eat humans and stuff. Like it's, she's so different. So we don't know how she works. And that's also why she's such a mystery to Muzan. That's why he wants her dead. <laughs> he can't control her. He won't no. allow her to become stronger. Uh, and he will use... Uh, I hate how he uses uh, uh, Daki. So she, she... I mean, she is his demon. Like, she, she does whatever he wants him to... Uh, whatever he wants. But the fact that he kind of, you know, he calls her names and he's like, oh, you're beautiful. You're the you're only the one that best. I can trust to do this. She's the lowest of the upper six. Like, she's not the, the only one who can do that. But by giving her compliments, she's in adoration of him. So by giving her compliments, he really motivates her to do what he wants. He makes sure she will not betray him, not go against his, his orders or anything. Mm -hmm. She won't let her own feelings get in the way of what she wants to do for Muzan. So he manipulates her with her feelings and stuff. When we all know he doesn't give a fucking shit <laughs> about her. We saw how he yeah. treated uh, uh, Upper Two mm. when uh, he, uh, he fucking defeated Hashira and then he fled because the sun was getting up and Muzan took that as an offense. Oh, you left them alive. You sure it's an upper two, not upper three? I think he was upper two, but I could be wrong. Hmm. It doesn't it doesn't matter. He was one of the strongest. Yeah. Uh, but there is still someone stronger than him and we haven't seen him yet, I think. <laughs> so I'm excited for that. But uh, in the meantime, yeah, Nezuko's kicking ass. Uh, Tanjiro's gonna have to heal and Tengen is on his way with the boys. So I'm really, really excited to see that. And... Uh, the fact that we managed, it took a lot, like it took a lot of, uh, of efforts and a lot of pain, but we still kept our own and we almost cut her neck twice. Almost, almost, man. Yeah, so if we can do that, I'm hoping Tengen can just fucking kick her ass. I'm she sure, wants I'm beautiful, sure she wants beautiful, she wants fast, well, he's she, coming. She's gonna be blinded by his beauty. She's gonna so... want to capture him alive and that's, <laughs> that's, the, that's a mistake. That's gonna be a downfall. Uh, I think she's obsessed with the idea of killing Hashira, because Muzan, but, and now she's got her full power with her, and, and, and so, okay, we, we talked, by the way, about how it looked like she had kind of two persona, like the ribbon and her, but it's just a part of herself that she left behind, kind of yeah. like a clone, so that one gained the memories that it gained, and it, when it ran back to her, she got the memories of that other thing, so, now she's stronger, by the way, she looks like a fucking, like, the uh, vegetable with her hair. <laughs> I'm thinking Atsune Miku the whole time. <laughs> and uh, an onion, there you go. But uh, our poor are, are you really calling her a, a green onion? Yeah, her hair has the color <laughs> of a green onion. Uh, but uh, in any case, I'm, I want to see faster, stronger, flashier, and he's coming. So you want beautiful? You'll get it. Harder, faster, better. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Okay. Yeah, something like that. Uh, so yeah, this is it for this episode. Uh, we'll move on unless you want to talk about something else. No. So thank you guys so much for watching this with us. If you want to see the next two episodes right away, they are on Patreon mm -hmm. already. You can check them out. The link is in the description below. And if you don't, the next one will be on YouTube next week. So you're going to see you then. Next week or, well, two check. a week. Yeah, so check community, guys. Bye. Bye.